Hi folks, I'm here today to demonstrate to you a stomach massage for someone who is experiencing uh, digestive issues and we're going to show you what we do here at Somatic Massage Therapy. So right now we got clearance from a doctor. We always like to get clearance to make sure that there's nothing going on inside that we need to be aware of. So now we got our clearance, we're going to go ahead and do first, I like to do a lymphatic drainage. So I'm gonna start my lymphatic drainage. There's a little bit of pressure here. First, let me just adjust here. Break this down a little bit. Okay. And just a little bit of pumping motion here. We know the lymphatic drainage system. The lymphatic system is one of the most important systems in the human body. Uh, it removes um, debris. Uh, it keeps us alive. Um, so we have nodes that's all in her stomach. In our stomach, we have nodes that's all over in the stomach here. So we're just gonna go ahead and do a little bit of drainage. And a very light touch. And we do the upper quadrant here. This up a little bit. And it's just more of a pumping motion, not too hard. And we can clear the inguin, uh, the nodes right in here, the inguin nodes. And our uh, nodes are usually in the joints because the heart is what pumps the blood in the system. There's nothing that is pumping the, the lymph. So this is why it's placed in the joints because we move and that causes to uh, do its thing in um, drainage. All right, so now we did um, some drainage without the oil. What I'm gonna do next, I'm just gonna add some oil. And we're gonna do circular motion going up onto the intestine. So we know the intestine in the human body is about 22 to 25 feet long, the large intestine. And wrapped around inside here, we have the small intestines about, I'm sorry, so the large intestine is about 20, uh, five feet long, five to six feet long. and the small intestine that's wrapped around in here is about 20 to 25 feet long. This is why when you see little babies, the bellies are extended because the large, the small, small intestine is wrapped around in there. As they get older, it starts to, the stomach starts to come in. Okay, so now we did the lymphatic drainage. I'm gonna add some oil, which I have my oil here. Now I usually have my own oil, I like to use um, Ginger, ginger is very good for drainage as well. So, get that oil all around here. And I start to work my way up, circular motion. And we have, work across um, the large intestine and work our way down. Now, a lot of people have digestive issues because of the uh, standard American diet. It's not enough uh, roughage in our diet. Uh, most of the food that we eat is processed. And just work my way around. How are you feeling? Feels good. Good. All right. A couple of times. So we work our way up over transverse and then in the descending. Okay. Also, I like to get underneath and kind of come up a little bit and twist. Okay. 
again up and twist the next thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna use the cupping machine that also helps with drainage all right so I have a cupping machine here that we use a lot on the customers uh, it doesn't hurt this is not the traditional Chinese cupping uh, we do not park the cup on the client because it leaves a cup kiss, which is uh, most people call a bruise. It's not a bruise, it's just more of a cup kiss that usually uh, will heal. All right, so I'd like to start right over here. First, I'm going to turn the pressure down. I'm down to about a six. And I'm just going to start right here. See, it sucks right in and it releases and I just work my way up the colon and come across and I just get a couple of pumps on one area Does that hurt? How does it feel? It feels wonderful. Good. So it doesn't hurt the customer at all. It actually feels really great. We come across the transverse and then down the descending. All right, so if we do a couple of that, then the next thing you do, I'm just gonna put it on steady suction. Turn the pressure down again. And I'm just gonna add a little bit more oil. Like I said, I usually, uh, for the lymphatic drainage, I usually make, uh, add a little bit of uh, ginger, because ginger is known to uh, help with drainage. So, go right over here and work my way up and across, nice and slow. And I can just retract the stomach here, come across again and work my way up. And you can always release the cup by just sticking your finger right underneath. Very simple. Work my way up, across, and down. Right into the, the duodenum. All right, so we come up again. How you feeling? Good. Good.
All right, so we did a liver lymphatic drainage. We did some cupping onto her stomach. Uh, we also did some hand massages to her stomach. Uh, like I said, we went up, transverse, and then down into the duodenum. And uh, we went on eating her lower back and some twists. You can do some more lymphatic drainage. when we drain the fluids over here, we try to bring it down into the inguinal nodes. And conclude with a pump. We can do a liver shake as well. Three times. All right. And we can do some Apartment over the navel. Well, that concludes the video. Thank you for watching. I hope that was very informative, and we hope to see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.